Former head of the Jamaica Constabulary Force Community Safety and Security Branch, James Forbes, has expressed relief after the Court of Appeal this morning overturned his corruption conviction. Mr. Forbes was a rising star in the police force, and the conviction cut short his career. Now, he says he's been vindicated. Anthony Lugg has the story. The outcome of the appeal for the matter involving former Superintendent Francis Forbes is one that was well anticipated. Forbes was found guilty of attempting to pervert the course of justice over an incident involving a traffic ticket that was issued to businessman Bruce Bicknell back in 2014. He was accused of interfering in the matter, which saw Member of Parliament Darrell Vaz and Bicknell being charged. However, they were later acquitted. After more than six years... The appeal is allowed. Number two, the appellant's conviction and sentence are set aside. Number three, judgment and verdict of acquittal entered. Number four, the sum of $800,000 paid by Mr. James Forbes, the appellant, is to be refunded to him forthwith. Speaking on Radio Jamaica's call-in program hotline following the judgment, Mr. Forbes said he was deeply hurt by the conviction. And for that parish to be on my repetition was for me a significant wound. I was deeply wounded. I was I was I was um, concerned for my, my, my family, my, my kids who had me as their role model were were wounded and um, that to me was, was even a heavier load to carry. So of course, you know, um, those were issues that were of great concern to me and I'm I'm delighted and, and I thank the the Jamaican people who who went on their knees and prayed. There were many, many groups and many, many persons, many, many individuals who called and expressed their support. There were groups of people who were having fasting and prayers, people I've never met, people I don't know. So the prayer warriors can be assured that God answers prayer. Despite the good news for Forbes, it's understood that the former senior cop will not be returning to the JCF. TBJ News has learned that he had been working with a leading hotel chain following the conviction. Meanwhile, MP for West Portland, Daryl Vaz, has also been reacting to the judgment. I wish him well, and I hope that he will be able to continue helping to, trail, to blaze the trail of nation building in Jamaica, especially now that he once again has an unblemished record. So I really want to give thanks to the Almighty for that, and as I always say, who oh God bless no man curse. Forbes at the time had insisted to his attorneys that no agreement was reached at the meeting and that he was not aware at the time that Bicknell had been charged. Anthony Log, TVJ News.